Hi, hi, how are you? How are you today? Fine, teacher, and you? I'm fine, too. Nice. A ver, ¿cómo está la lluvia en el resto de, de la clase, verdad? Aquí ha estado lloviendo bastante. Sí, bastante, bastante. En San Miguel. ¿Lloré en San Miguel, Carlita? Sí. Oh. Well, here too, it was raining very, very hard. But right now it has stopped. Uh, we see what happens later on. Sure. Como, como está. And to see how many people connect, <laughs> right? Because with the rain, sometimes that's a problem. Pero sí llovió, llovió súper fuerte, ahorita se ha calmado un poco. Sí, sí, bastante, bastante fuerte. Llovió. A ver qué tal, a ver cómo sigue. Porque sí, a veces este, se complica ¿verdad? Con, la, con la lluvia, el tráfico y todo, se pone, se pone loco. Sí. A ver, ok, now we are seven. Hmm. Hello, Elsa Cristina, how are you? Are you better? Ok, yes, I am feel so very well. Uh, yesterday, so sorry, I couldn't hear your class. Uh, I thought, oh, I think I, I, I fell asleep <laughs> and I didn't hear anything uh, after uh, after uh, 80, 80, after 880, I couldn't hear anything. I fell asleep. Yeah, I imagine. imagine. But now I, I, I am feel better. You're better. That's good. Yeah. That's positive, right? That's positive that you're improving. Yeah. Because it's very delicate, especially now that it's raining, you go out and then the drops of water. So yeah. Hopefully, hopefully today I walk from my house, my home. Mm -hmm. And I uh, I I don't uh, leave my house. Yes. I don't. I didn't leave. I you didn't leave. You didn't go out today. Yeah. Didn't go out. Better. Better. Like that, you take care, right? You relax a little bit. Yeah. But I'm glad that you're better. Nice. That's right. <laughs> Vamos a ver, let's start, Adriana María. Adriana María. No here. Ok, Adriana Sofía. Present teacher. 
Ana. Cruz Antonio. Present. Nice. David. David. David, David. No hay David. Eddie. Eddie, Eddie. Elmer Fabricio. Elsa Cristina. Present. Okay. Mm -hmm. Felix. Felix, Felix. No here. Grace Mitchell. Grace Mitchell. Ivo Marcela. Mm -hmm. Jennifer Elizabeth. José Alberto. José Alberto. José Alfredo. Present teacher. Carla Lorena. Present teacher. Teacher, ahora voy a estar de oyente. Ok. Ok, Carlita. Eh, Mario. Very, very, very. Present, Mario, present. Eh, Nubia Azulema. No, Nubia Azulema. No, here, Nubia. Rebecca. Present, teacher. Rosailda. Present, teacher. Victor. Present, teacher. Claudia Guadalupe. Present, teacher. Mauricio. Present. Present, teacher. Nice. Good evening. Good evening. A ver, anybody came late after I call you? Adriana Maria. Elmer Fabricio. Ana. David. Eddie. Elmer Fabricio. Present teacher. Felix. Grace Michelle. Ivo Marcela. Jennifer Elizabeth. Jose Alberto. Nubia. Ok. Bueno. How was your, your day? Nice. Nice, nice. Hey, how was your day? Hola. Hello. Vaya pues, ya no les pregunto cómo les fue. It's a hard day, teacher. What's a hard day? Mm -hmm. Why? Feels, feels like a Monday. Really? No, I guess it's the accumulation of all the week, right? The accumulation you're, you have four days working today is normal, right? But you feel kind of. But tomorrow is Friday. See, verdad? <laughs> tomorrow is Friday. So you will be. Sleeping. Me, yo no tengo filtro. ¿Qué pasó con este Zoom? Give me a second. Mm -hmm. Let's see. A mí que me olvida dónde le pone cosas. Sí. 
Más que me he dado vuelta. Me he dado vuelta en la, en la, en mi, en mi estudio. <ríe> Vaya. Ok. Let's see, hoy sí, hoy sí. Well, this is our class number 21. Let's check again. There we go. Class number 20, 21. Four more and we finish, right? And today, we start, teacher. only four. Four more and we finish. We finish uh, next week, next Wednesday. When it start the next level? No idea when, but we finish on Wednesday. I imagine the the next course will begin like a, like in about a week or something like that. I hope, right? Bye, let's see. Check the objective is uh, to acquire new vocabulary about brand awareness. Remember, we have been talking all this unit. We have been talking about branding. Yes, about branding. Now, look at the article, read the article about the importance of being first to create a memorable brand. What is the importance of being first? What do you think? Before we go read, what do you think is the importance of being first to create a memorable brand? Mm -hmm. Any idea? Don't go to read for, uh, first. Tell me, what do you think is the importance? Yes, yes. Okay. Well, I'm going to send you in groups for you to go read the importance. Uh, go to page 32. Read the importance of being first. And then you come and share with me. Um, go ahead. Join, join, join. Mauricio, join the group. Elmer, Fabricio, Claudia, Carla, Mario, Rebecca, join. No. No, no, no. Okay. So we are going to read that. Maybe you can start. No. Why? Nadie habla. Huh? Nadie está hablando. Uh, uh, can you start the Yes. About four years ago, marketing strategies are Riz and Jack throw offered the world away to think about making a brand memorable. The best way to be remembered is to be first into 
your prospect's prospect mind representing a clear reception. Think about all the brands that have become synonyms with their function. Stop tape, wings, tags. It is no accident. They were also the first. People love to know what is new. Mm. We can help ourselves, marketers, know it is too. If a product gets our attention, and if a really is new, it gets more, more than our attention. It gets remembered. Uh, pausa. It's easier pausa for what? No, o sea, ¿cuál era la pregunta para entender y adoptar? We, we need to read this, this uh, story and then answer the question. That mm -hmm. are in there. And then we need to understand what we are, to what we are talking about. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. Right now, I'm. It is easy to just copy business idea, political position, or organizational mission. 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 mission from someone else. But, but if someone else already has gotten into respect mine uh, with the same perspective you have, hope to create. You will find it's hard to push them out. I prefer is to pick a different perspective, uh, one that you can be the, the first to put in your prospect mind. Netflix will have never made in a, in it if real housing idea has been to up. <laughs> Who offered the concept of memorial branding? Está. Marcarlo. Memorial. Yo lo acabo de leer. <clears throat> Aquí está bien. All Rice and Jack Trout. What are some brands that have become synonymous with a function add three more than these ones yeah um, <laughs> for moms pampers <laughs> for girls <laughs> cut <laughs> when is on marca vea yes los clinics <laughs> también a ver qué otra marca Fíjate que no, porque esas tres, o sea, de hoggies es más común la de pampers. Porque la gente llama Pampers a los pañales desechables, pero el nombre correcto es pañal desechable. Pampers. ¿Qué otro? Pues siento que tengo otro así como que en la punta de la lengua y no me acuerdo. Así que te digo que es para las chicas. También son, no se llaman así. 
ver. Scotch tape, Linux, Xerox. El cornflakes, no sé. Está bien. En vez del cereal, vea. El cornflakes. Cornflakes. Ok, next. What is a better alternative to creating the perception of an already existing product? Por aquí estaba. ¿Qué se me hicieron? ¿Qué se hizo? A ver. A better alternative to creating a perception of an already existing product. It is easier to just copy a business idea, but if someone else already has gotten into your prospective minds with the same perception you have hoped to create, A better plan está. is to pick a different perception. What will have happened if we testing that open rent a video stores instead of innovating the service? Huh? Net Netflix would have never made it if Reed Hastings' idea had been to open a bunch of stores to compete with Blockbuster. ¿Quién era Reed Hastings? Reed Hastings. ¿Buscar? Es una marca. What will have happened if Reed has to? Go to place oh. to the movies. It's como el creador de Netflix. Reed Hastings. Okay. What would have happened if Reed Hastings had opened rent a video stores instead? Ah, yeah, then, yeah, then. Pues que, ah, sí, porque o sea, el negocio de él fue, digamos, Netflix. Ajá, uh -huh. que, o sea, ¿qué hubiera pasado sí. si solamente copia a Blockbuster a en Blockbuster. el video? Uh -huh. ¿Cómo se llama? ¿Cómo se dice? Hubiera fracasado. Hubiera fracasado, <risa> sí. ¿no? O no hubiera tenido la demanda que tiene, o sea, del, del, del servicio, ¿verdad? Sí, le hubiera pasado lo mismo que la poster. Disappears. Yeah. Okay. Pero no dice aquí, ¿verdad? Ok, eso es como, no puede ser como personal, ¿eh? Ay, no, no me sale chunche este para escribir. ¿Qué le pasó? Aquí está. Okay, what would have happened if Reed Hastings had opened Renabity stores instead of Innovative Service? 
she she como se pone No sé si decline o... She would... Build. Okay. Así será. Fracasado. Uh -huh. No, okay, espérate. Okay. Her, she will have failed as blog post. She will have failed. Mm -hmm. So, don't be a teacher anymore. Or don't exist anymore. Could be. Yeah. Sure, huh? Could be. No, no, es que ahí cuando dice cubrí está dejando abierta la posibilidad. Uh -huh. Eso es el negativo. Netflix don't, don't exist anymore. Uh -huh. Ah, creo que no. Sí, sí. No sé si fue una vez ahí. ¿Cómo? No, pero me necesito cómo se escribe, se lo voy a buscar. Sí, así. I see where what did Netflix do differently? You pay a membership monthly and you have unlimited access to all the movies and series and series. And you don't have to pay additional fees for dealers. Additional creo que doble de verdad. Hola. Hola, teacher. Hi. Additional, yeah. Okay, we're finished. Excellent. Did you finish? Almost just number number five and six. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you read and answer the questions. Okay. Maybe yes. Page thirty-two. Eh, ese lo hicimos ayer. Uh -huh. We are in the reading. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Okay. This one. Okay. Uh -huh. You have to read and then you answer the questions. Mm -hmm. Okay.
Ay, Carlita, no está, ¿verdad? No. Ok. Me la voy a llevar a esa crecina. Basha. Basha. Did you answer the questions? No. Number three. Vamos, teacher. Okay, go. Cool. What is a better alternative to creating the reception of an already existing product? I don't know. It's in the reading. The answers, the answers to those questions are in the reading. Hi, teacher. Hi. Finished. Do you remember? We use a uh, answer the question. Mm -hmm. You read the reading, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And then you answer the questions. Uh huh. Yes, teacher. Just wait a minute for one group that hasn't finished. Well, anyway, in one minute, I think they finished. Let's go. Okay. Thank you, sir. Okay. Pasha. Do you have any questions about the article? In the last paragraph, I guess I I see a, a, a word that I I don't understand. Mm -hmm. Side stepped. Side stepped. Mm -hmm. Side stepped. Yeah, t shirt. Okay. Oh. Okay, according to the dictionary, to the Cambridge Dictionary, that's the one I always share. Vamos a ver qué dice. A sidestep is the pass of sidestep. Let's see. Um, I think it's like to pass, to pass something, to, 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 want to solve them. Mm -hmm. Evitar. Uh -huh. Yeah, but it say that uh, the traffic create a, a perception of it of itself. Uh -huh. so uh -huh. They jump. They jump them. Uh -huh. They avoid them. Yeah. They avoid them. That, that's the meaning. Mm -hmm. Do you remember Blockbuster? No. Are you yes. too young? For... <laughs> yes, I'm, I'm, I'm a baby boy. 
Yeah, I know, I know. Yeah, but the ones that are key, like about my age. And you, uh, you see like three movies in BS case? Ah, está viejito entonces. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> I, I don't rent that. It's, I don't remember how I see that, but I don't rent the, the movies. Probably somebody in your house did it. Right? Okay. So, vamos a ver. What other old brand is mentioned here? Let's see. Mm -hmm. So, it's about 40, yes, about 40 years ago. Marketing is and Japanese. The world, a way to think about making a brand memorable. Awesome. What was the best way to be remembered in that time? Imagine, okay, four years ago. Well, some of you were not born at that time, right? What was the best way to be memorable or to be, or to be remembered by people? Mm -hmm. Because that is uh, to be memorable, right? To be the first in people's minds. Mm -hmm. But what was the best way to be memorable? Uh -huh. Think about those brands that you see there, Scotch tape, Kleenex, Xerox. I don't know if it still exists, Xerox. Las impresoras y las fotocopias. Uh -huh. Right? Uh -huh. Yeah, too. They still exist. Yeah. They still exist. Okay. Okay, check. People love to know what is new, right? And in those times, the marketers knew that people love to know what is new, right? And they were always trying to get the people's attention. But uh, remember, the common thing was making commercials and making commercials that had to be very attractive to people, right? To call people's attention and to get people to, to remember the, the product, right? Or the brand that they were presenting. For example, if you were thinking about a photocopy, the first thing you, came, you brought to mind was setups, right? If you were thinking about a, a washing machine or a refrigerator, that was general, general key, electric, right? <laughs> In this day, possibly is Mabe. Mm, completely. I would say it's more frigidaire. It's more famous than Mabe. Mabe is not sold in, in every in every store. But wherever you go, you can find a fridge there. I tell you because I was hanging around in, in, in La Curacao today and I saw nothing Mave. So it depends on the store, probably the type of brands that they have, right? But I saw no Mave. I saw fridge there. I saw General Electric. Kitchen too? In kitchen and in refrigerator. Well, Mave is small kitchen, but no in La Curacao, they don't have Mave. So it depends uh, the stores, right? But uh, you will say like the most famous or that are looking for going to the number one are those brands that you can find in any store, not just in one, right? So they, be, they have to be uh, more famous in, in different stores. Okay, and check. It is easier to just copy business idea, political position, or organizational mission from someone else. That, if someone else already has gotten into our prospect's mind with the same perception you have hoped to create, you'll find it is hard to push them out, right? And if you notice that happens with the, with the songs, right? That 
when people make a song and if another one comes like with the idea of changing that song, people will not accept it, right? And if you, if somebody has gotten the idea of a brand or a product, keep that into their mind that they think is the best thing to buy. It is very difficult to take that out of the people's mind. So you have to be very careful, okay? And so they say, well, a better plan is to pick a different perception. One that you can be the first to put into your prospect's mind. Who's the prospect? The people you want to serve, right? And that's why uh, they are mentioning Netflix, that Netflix, Netflix came in that moment when there was a change that Blockbuster didn't exist anymore, right? And they started taking that market. market. Instead of renting movies, now people pay Netflix to watch movies or watch TV or different uh, cable channels, right? Well, let's see the questions. Who offered the concept of memorial branding? Who? You had the name of a person there. Uh -huh. Who offered the concept of memorial branding? All right, Sanjak through the most. Okay, thank you, Victor. What are some brands that have become synonymous with their function? Rinso. Hmm? Which ones? Rinso. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah, but why Rinso? Because it's the brand and you don't, you recognize uh, the product for the name. <coughs> uh, don't matter is another brand. Aha, uh aha, -huh, uh -huh, exactly. So you want to buy detergent, you don't say, compras detergente, compras rims. Well, in my case, it was compra sedex, but now I buy whatever, <laughs> right? But, uh -huh. Another, another uh, one, another brand that has become a synonym. Maruchan. Maruchan, okay. Why? Why Maruchan? The same ex uh, example, teacher. Mm. Maybe you don't buy Maruchan. Maybe another brand. Okay. Lucky. No, but lucky is not. It's not the same. Uh huh. One more. One more. One more. Women. There is one that we use a lot. I and mean, maybe it's not the brand we're buying, but we call it that way. Uh-huh. Teacher, the brand Cotex. Exactly. That's the one I was thinking, right? So we say compras Cotex, but we don't buy that brand. We may buy another brand, right? But uh, it has become a synonym of, of, of the product, right? Okay. Or Kleenex, right? Compras Kleenex. And probably you're not buying that brand Kleenex. You're buying something else. Okay. Uh, what is a better alternative to creating the perception of an already existing product? Uh-huh. 
What is a better alternative to creating the perception of an already existing product? Mm. Okay. A different perception, one that you can be the first, the first put into your prospect mind. Okay. What would have happened if Reed Hastings had opened rent a video stores instead of innovating the service? Netflix don't exist anymore or probably not be successful. Exactly. Uh, well, not even the computers have now a DVD player, right? Or a CD player. It's very strange to get one that contains a TV player or a DVD player. So that would not be probably acceptable or not even successful, right? What did Netflix do differently? Mm -hmm. What did Netflix do differently? Uh, creating a perception of itself as the go-to place to rent movies online. Okay, yes. Well, let's move here. Uh, look at the questions you have at the beginning on page 33. Should a small business invest on raising brand awareness? What do you think? What is brand awareness? Do you remember what, what it means to say aware? I'm aware of something. What does it mean? Mm -hmm. Okay, can you repeat? Uh -huh. But adapted to the topic, what does it mean? Mm -hmm. Should a small business invest on raising brand awareness? Okay. okay, I'm going to send you to the group, chicos. Porque ahí así lo veo que hablan y aquí no quieren. Eh, go, discuss the questions and then practice the conversation and answer eh, the questions. Go ahead. Join the groups. Join, join.
Join, José Alfredo, Claudia, Adriano. Brenda, what are you using like knowledge? Mm -hmm. So, we are going to start reading the conversation. Mm -mm. Discuss the questions. Mm -hmm. Yes. A ver, a ver. ¿Quién va a ser Celia y Lucas? Victor. Mario y, 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 y Rosy, yo voy a ser moderador. Víctor, discuss the questions first. Discuss ah, discuss the questions. Ok. Nos mandé al grupo porque allá en general nadie quiere hablar y en los grupos chiquitos. Sí. Vaya, Rosy, pues son la, es la, las preguntas anteriores de la 32. No, es esa chula, small business, invest or raising, brand awareness. También me dijo que estaba preparada. Pues. No, para la 32, no para la 33. Should, ok, should a small business invest or raising brand awareness? Mm. Question, what do you think? Children best? I think, yes. Why? Because. A target client or customers. Uh, they can invest uh, on their brand. Uh, for example, can you name a pair of strategies to increase a product's brand awareness? Same question. Know. I think that it is important because uh, why? I don't know. Number one. <laughs> the the same sure a small business. The same. Yes. Yes. The small business in person racing brand awareness. <clears throat> yes, uh, as I say Rosa. I... We could do that. Number one, two and three. Discuss the question for the part one and read the conversation. And then one the question, part three. Teacher, we should to match the words or read the conversation. Okay, yo entiendo que vamos a, a responder. In English, Anna, discuss the questions in activity. No, the, discuss the question. Mm -hmm. Should a small business in, invest on raising brands? Should that invest on awareness? What do you understand with brand awareness? The recognize recognize the brand. La fortaleza podría. When the client recognizes recognize the brand and the quality. The quality. Yes, they have to invest in, in because customers have to know what they are buying or what they are using. They, they are going to 
be a loyalty customers about the brand because they are, they they know what the product is what the product is good yes so i think it's, uh -huh. it's important that the business the the whole business invest on race in this racing and brand awareness. It's important. I am going to look for something about this for read for reading. In the next page, I think the, the definition is I don't know. What awareness is. What is it? You can read that. Ok, vamos a ver, fíjese, eh, Alberto, que ahí había mandado cuatro personas. ¿Ves? Me dejó en el limbo, Ticha. Lo mandé con... Me sentía, me sentía flotando. Sí, fíjese que lo mandé con cuatro personas, pero lastimosamente, no sé, Grace no está conectada, creo. O sea, está, pero no está. José Alfredo, me imagino que va en la moto. Y Carlita, veo que está trabajando. Vamos a ver, sí. Vale. Ok. Ya no lo vamos a mandar ahí. Vamos a mandarlo a otro grupo. Ay, qué barbaridad. Vale, muchas gracias, Ticha. Vamos a ver. Si es que ese es lo triste de que de repente eh, no me dicen y se quedan trabajando y después el pobre compañero queda solito, ¿verdad? Vaya. Eh, let's see. Tell me. Should a small business invest on raising brand awareness? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, teacher. Uh -huh. Why? Because a small company has greater risk when competing with large companies. Exactly. Exactly. And the thing is that if nobody knows about them, they will not attract people, right? Okay. Can you name a pair of strategies to increase? Uh, teacher, teacher. Hola. I want to comment in the first. Mm -hmm. When a small business invests on raising brand, um, in raising brand awareness, it it's um it gets to position the brand in the mind to the to the okay. customer. Uh -huh. Um there is there is a lot of advantage to invest on that. Definitely. That will be, that will bring a raising on, on sales. In addition, the, the growing of the brand. Mm -hmm. That's all. Exactly. Thank you, Victor. Can you name a pair of strategies to increase a product's brand awareness? What can you do? What is strategies? I have one. Mm -hmm. Tell me. Okay. 
And one strategy is, for example, to make community labor mm -hmm. when you help to 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 make when when you make social labor in in some communities, you position the brand. For example, some uh, there was a station radio that carry out water to some communities that don't don't get water. That is a, a social labor. And uh, some companies approach to position the brand. Okay. So you see, it, and definitely that is a, a good way of getting, like getting to know, right? To get people. Another... Tell me, Anna. Sorry, Elmer. Another example, I was looking and they say infographics. These infographics are a bright and colorful way to display interesting marketing data. Uh, dice que this contact powerhouse often get shared far and wide, making them a great tool for brand building and through leadership. Okay. Uh huh. That's of course that's a, a way, right? And also um, remember social media, right? That's a very a very good way of making people. Be no. Create an advertising campaign mm -hmm. to pre-launch the product or service. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Next Another step. example, they say freebies. Everyone loves free stuff. Put your brand name on cushies, pen, frisbees. They give away your items at local festivals. Even your pen, a pencil, if you get right that that has the brand, uh, people will be using that pen and others will see the brand. So that's a good way of making uh, your brand become more popular among people. Okay, great, great, great. Now let's move. Now we have the conversation. Let's just listen and tell me if you have any question and then I'm going to send you to practice. I just discovered this new brand of cinnamon soda. It's delicious, but when I visited their fan page, I saw they only have 300 likes. I wonder why it isn't more popular. It's probably an unknown brand, simply put. The owners of the brand aren't trying to put her to are trying to hard to create brand awareness of their product. This is very important when launching a new product. I guess you're right. Everyone knows about Coca-Cola and Pepsi, but I have never seen an ad for this new soda on TV. Well, yes, consumers are aware of these brands and their images and names. In other words, the cinnamon soda you are talking about needs to make people recognize it to get higher shelves and become more competitive. Any questions here about vocabulary or pronunciation? Questions? No questions? Simple food, simple food. It's like a, a, a view. Just for view something, you you know what is it? Mm -hmm. Like, okay, saying that in simple words, right? Like when you, I, what's the word? Let me see. Um, I forgot the word. But you have an idea and then you put it in your words like to be easy explained or easy understood, right? Mm -hmm. So you say like, okay, in simple things, just 
the thing is that they aren't trying hard to to create to me so they it's not easy to to understand too easy to say or 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 like that mm -hmm. exactly exactly putting it simple right putting it simple like to make it simple right we can say that they just simply are not making a marketing of the product, right? They are not trying too hard. So if you just create a page, but you think that only by creating a page, you're getting everything is not, right? So you have to make more things. Thank you, Rosie. Okay, now let's see attendance. Let's go to the attendance here. Uh, Adriana Maria. Adriana Sofia. Present. Y Adriana Maria no estaba por allí. Adriana. Adriana Maria. No. Adriana María, la veo conectada, pero no. Ahí hay una Adriana Escalante, yo creo que ella es. Pero no está, creo yo. Adriana Sofía. Ana. Present. Present, teacher. Cruz. Present, teacher. David. No, David, ¿verdad? Eddie Jonathan. Aquí, teacher. Eddie. Sí, 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 presenta, teacher. Ok. Elmer Fabricio. Present, teacher. Elsa Cristina. Present. Félix. Félix. No, ¿verdad? No, here. No here. Eh, Grace Michelle. Grace. Don Marcela. Jennifer. Present. Jorge Alberto. Present teacher. Eh, Carla Loren. No. Jorge Alfredo. José Alfredo José Alfredo José Alfredo José Alfredo José Alfredo José Alfredo, José Alfredo por allí no vi al micrófono. O sea, Alfredo, no. Okay. Carla, Lorena. Presente. Mario, Mario. That is me. I'm here. Ok, Nubia. Present teacher. Rebecca. Present teacher. Rosy. Present teacher. Victor. Present teacher. Claudia Guadalupe. Present teacher. Mauricio. Present teacher. Vamos a ver acá. Felix que no me salen los números eh, a ver Ivonne Marcela no here right 
Jennifer Shin. Grace es la que está por allí, pero no está por allí. Ok. Pero no me daban los números. ¿Cómo es que no veo cuatro, pero, pero me faltan tres? <ríe> ok, vaya, hoy sí. Eh, ok, no questions about the conversation. No questions. No. no teacher, thank you. Ok, vaya, vámonos pues. I'm going to send you to, but in pairs, because we will practice the conversation. I'm going to make groups again. Mm -hmm. Okay. So. Mm -hmm. Vaya, José Alberto, lo voy a mandar con alguien que está aquí para que no te soy listo. Voy a mandar con un pobrecito. <ríe> Allá solito. Vamos a ver. Quiero ver. Y pidió ayuda, José Alberto. Eh, solito. ¿Cómo no? Pero no me hacían caso. <ríe> no, qué barbaridad. Vamos a ver, vaya. If you see that your partner doesn't arrive, call me, okay? Cha, 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 cha. Elmer sí está, ¿verdad? Elmer y Elmer. Nubia, hello. Bye, vámonos. Join, remember, you will practice the conversation and answer the questions. Okay, Bye. Yeah. I am going to say uh -huh. mm -hmm. yeah, I'm yes, I, look am. I just I just discovered the, this new brand of cinnamon soda. It's delicious. But when I visited their fan page, I saw they only have 300 likes. Wonder why it isn't more popular. It's probably an unknown brand. Simple put, the owners of the brand aren't trying too hard to create brand awareness for their product. This is very important when launching a new product. Anna. Celia. Oh, no. Oh, 
es solito otra vez. ¿Qué dice? Ay, no, José, José Alberto, again. <risa> Barbaridad. No sé qué pasa, Ticha. Ay, no. Y lo mandé con Ana porque se supone que está. Vaya. Pero oh. tiene internet inestable, dice. Pues lo voy a cambiar de grupo. Es un new, sí, verdad, un new friend. What is an important step to consider when launching a new product? Is Cruz there, Adriana Sofía, or you're alone? No. Con, eh, aquí estamos con Cruz. Cruz, Cruz. No, no. Ah, ahí les traje a Alberto. Okay. It's raining here. Oh. Ahí se me olvidó que iba. <laughs> What is an important step to consider when launching a new product? Uh, the owners of the brand are trying to hard to create brand awareness for the product. To create. Yeah. Brand awareness. Sí es. Yes. Ah, okay. What is Lucas recommendation for the cinnamon soda to get more sales? Oh. Oh no. Dude. Oh, no. wow. What is an important step to consider when launching a new product? Create a brand awareness. Mm -hmm. Create a brand awareness. Así. Sí.
there and then the to make that the people Recognize. Oh, people recognize it. Yeah. Uh huh. So the consumers are aware of these brands in their image and niche, and talking about the brand, the cinnamon soda. Yeah. yeah. Um, that's all. <laughs> Yes, we finished, teacher. <laughs> mm -hmm. You have asked only one question. Yeah, yeah. Where yeah. there discuss talking. Okay. Yeah, but write the answers. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. So I think that you can you can write a uh, customer are aware of this brand image and names you can erase and there yeah. and there and and two yeah. image and name yeah okay second the second one has to uh, to consider create a grand awareness about needs, needs, needs to, make to make people people recon recognize 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 is to get to higher people recognize and become more competitive people recognize recognize so nice so nice it's yes it sería people recognize into the into get high como se pronuncia high to get high high higher 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 yeah higher sales and become become more competitive. More competitive. Bueno, entonces number one, why is cinnamon soda not so popular? It is probably on 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 our brand. An unknown, unknown, unknown. 
con la nariz no means that no nobody knows them. That sounds. Mm -hmm. And uh, no, no. Brown. Uh -huh. That means nobody knows them. They are unknown. No. No, no, okay. What is an important step to consider when launching a new product? Uh, to create brand awareness. Awareness, 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 um, ah, sí. Four. Tail. Pro. Mm -hmm. Y otras. What is Lucas recommendation for the cinnamon soda to get more sales? To make people recognize it to get high. Ay, esta palabra no la puedo decir. Ay, como dijo teacher, perdón. Higher. 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 No voy a notar. Higher. 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 Sales and become more competitive. Bah. Higher. 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 Okay. Higher. Okay. Higher. 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 Oh, yeah. Okay. I first I use discovered this new brand of cinnamon soda. It is delicious. But when I visited their fan page, I seen they. Okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. We'll see what they are, everybody here. Let's see. Number one, why is cinnamon soda not so popular? Mm -hmm. it's brand. <laughs> why? Because it is an unknown brand. It is an unknown brand, yes. And what is an important step to consider when launching a new product? To create brand awareness for the product. 
definitely. And what is Jack's recommendation for the cinnamon soda to get more cells? Hmm? What is his recommendation? Make people recognize it to get a higher sound and become more competitive. Definitely. Okay. Wait, now check. What is brand awareness? Uh, a ver, Victor, can you help me read? What is brand awareness? Mm -hmm. No está Victor. Mi teacher. No, teacher, me. Go, no, okay. Jose Alberto. Okay, brand awareness. Mm -hmm. Brand awareness is the level of recognition as association by a potential customer towards your products and service. For example, if you need a cold drink, the chances are that you will think of Pepsi or Coke. Exactly, check, we have here recognition in association by potential customers to the product. Remember when we were saying, anda a comprar una bolsa de rinso. Probably you were buying que any other brand, right? But you say rinso. Me compras cotex, me compras clinic. And probably you're, you're looking for another brand, but the people. Me traes una marucha. <laughs> people associate, right? The brand with the unos churritos. Los chur... Exactly. Me compra unos churritos and probably you want nachos. You don't want churros, right? Or you want ¿Qué? frijolito chips. <laughs> but you say churros. Okay. What is brand awareness strategy? Let's see, Nubia, can you help me read? Yes, teacher. Um, a brand awareness strategy, strategy is a set of marketing tactics that help a company spread their message, grow their audience, and establish high brand recognition with the, their target target market. Mm -hmm. Exactly. The tactics, right? Those tactics that help spread, right? So everybody get to know. What are you going to do to make people know about you? Social media is the cheapest one now, right? Social media. If you see the video that is in the in the page we're working right now in the, in the manual, um, the most important thing that they recognize, uh, recommend there is social media because it's cheap, because everybody uses social media. That would be a good marketing tactic, right? For you to make your, your product or your brand awareness. Right, so people will know about you. Now, what are the three types of brand awareness, Mauricio? Yeah, teacher. Go ahead. Repeat, please. Mauricio, are you here? I don't hear you. Read, read the answer. Okay, Anna, can you help me? With pleasure, teacher. This ability of a product to be recognized by customers through general, excuse me, I am going to move the, the view. Uh -huh. Again, the ability of a product to be recognized by customers through general hints, clues, 
It's called brand awareness. Mm -hmm. There are mainly three types of brand awareness. Brand recall, brand recognition, brand dominance. Perceived value is underrated. And liability is an important aspect of making a trademark visible. Mm -hmm. The most important things here are brand recall, brand recognition, and brand dominance, right? The brand dominance is like the last one. What Coca-Cola has done, right? They have the domain of, okay, the, we can say refreshments, <laughs> right? If you, if you see, you say, I'm very thirsty. What do you think of? You don't think about water, right? Well, especially teenagers. I want a Coca-Cola, I am 30. If you're 30, you're supposed to drink water. But as the dominance of the brand uh, shows us that if you are 30, you go drink Coca-Cola, people think about that, right? What is brand recall? What does it mean recall? Like, recon like reconocida? No. Like remember. Uh -huh. For example, when you say Lido, hey, yo de Lido, no me olvido, right? So immediately, the, 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 what would be that? The jingle comes to your mind, right? You, you recall the brand, you recognize it anywhere you, you see it. For example, you see the, the check. And you listen to, what do you think about? Hmm? Again, please. And you have the check. Twitter. Um? <laughs> Twitter. No. <laughs> no, no, no. They are sneaking. Twitter. Huh? Twitter. No. It's a brand of shoes. Nike. Nike, uh -huh. Right, so you recognize them and you only see the check and you see Nike, right? And, and the last one that is the dominance, right? So wherever you go, you ask for Coca-Cola. You go to Pizza Hut and you're asking for Coca-Cola and they tell you, no, we have Pepsi, <laughs> right? But it's like the same. Okay, bird, bring me your chatter. Ajá, uh -huh. but horchata with pizza, no, como que, no much. <laughs> with pupusas, yes, but, but with pizza, no much, right? So these are the three types of brand awareness that we may have. So what is brand awareness? The recognition or association that of the product or brand, right? Mm -hmm. Now, what are some tips that we can follow to make a brand awareness campaign? One, understand your target customers. Who are my, my possible customers? Or who are the people I want to pay attention to my brand because are the ones that will buy it, right? But I have to understand them, to understand what they want. Another one, focus on the platforms your customers use the most. What platforms do people use the most? Hmm? For business? I think it's Instagram. No, no, the people, normal people. What do you use? WhatsApp. Hmm? WhatsApp. WhatsApp. Okay. Twitter. Twitter. Exactly. And not Facebook. John. People are not using Facebook much anymore, right? They move to Instagram. They move to TikTok. So. If I'm focusing, well, if I have a product that is for young people, 
I will not make or put my announcements or my advertisements in Facebook. I won't go to my to the market that I'm looking for, right? Because the ones that continue using Facebook are the ones that are over 40, right? But young people have moved to TikTok, have moved to, uh, to Instagram. Those are like the most famous now. Videos. They, now they want everything short, right? TikTok, one minute. 40 seconds, 45 seconds, and they want things like that. And that's why uh, the announcements can be like somebody was saying the infographics. You know, infographic doesn't have much information. They have a lot of colors. They are very attractive to people. And they can show the message like that quickly in a very uh, short form, like just with the most specific information that people want to see or need to see, right? Now, no more those very long announcements that we used to have on television that were appearing on television every time we were watching a movie that when all the commercials finished passing, you didn't remember what you were watching, right? Remember, right? Those commercials are not for teenagers. They are for adults. Because teenagers, if you ask them, they tell you, no, I don't watch television. And what do you do in your free time? I watch TikTok. I see Instagram. Some of them Twitter, but I think Twitter is not for TikTok. TikTok have ads. Hmm? TikTok have ads. I imagine they are uh, not like an ad in the middle of the video but they are like infographics, like at one side where your video are appearing here and they appear on one side. Like when you go to a blog too, you won't see an advertising, like a video in a... In a... Somebody, somebody here use TikTok to... Who to shows? TikTok? Here. I don't have time to watch TikTok, so I do not use it. A ver, who use a TikTok? No, I don't have it. You don't have TikTok. Déjenme hacer una. Me neither. <laughs> ¿Ah? TikTok. Ya vamos a, ya vamos a hacer la, 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 la entrevista aquí. A ver. Que no es de pena, bicho. <laughs> That means you are young. No sabe. I, I sent the question, vamos a ver. So we will come back to this question to see what platforms, but remember, depending on who you want to get to, right? A ver, tip, eh, tip number three. Mm. Ah, uh, you know what, what is coming to my mind right now? Uh, that, uh, that probably, uh, I'm waiting for the answer here. That probably here is the new thing now is you see influencers. Answer my question. Me manda un video que no puedo poner. Okay. But so I was thinking about influencers. Now, you know, the new thing is using influencers to, to talk about your, your, your product. So probably you will not see a commercial like that commercial, 
of the of the product, but you may have a uh, girls if you're talking about makeup, girls using your product and uh, uploading a TikTok of okay, 40 seconds, 30 seconds, Minute. talking about your product, right? So that is a, a way of yeah, that makes sense. Uh huh. That's a way of making people get aware of your product. You can see que, um, I don't know if you, well, you say you don't use TikTok, right? But probably you watch videos. Teacher, I remember that um, an old man with, uh, he, he was the drink, uh, a juice in a, in a, ¿cómo se dice? Patineta? Patineta. In a uh -huh. skateboarder? In a, no. Mm. A skateboarder. Right, uh, skate. Uh -huh. And... And uh, someone is 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 record the the video when and when he va uh, he drinking the the use the, the use in the bottle and the company uh, looked the, the video mm -hmm. or saw the video and it uh, they pay for 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 this for video right. forty seconds right of using it mm -hmm. okay. Okay, okay. Does TikTok have videos, infographics? How do they advertise products? Yes. Mm -hmm. Videos? I think so. You use TikTok. It smells like uh, Pizza Hut, like TV or YouTube. No, of course it's they are. Like someone is using like a pop-up. No, like Facebook. Uh-huh. No. It's like someone is using the product uh -huh. and the person presented. Like an influencer. Okay, you see what I was telling. Did you hear what my yeah. sister was saying? Yeah, I think that teacher i i'm not used tiktok but uh i think that if tiktok is a, a, like youtube a, they show uh a short information of uh, history about the problem uh all just the basic of the problem mm -hmm. i think what, what you use what she was saying i don't know if you heard her when she was telling me you use or they present people using the products, yeah. right? Like influencers, people using the products. So you say, well, I have this, and I appear showing it and telling you that this is the best to eliminate all the germs in your on your desk, right? So they make a, a, a key. It's not a it's not an advertising, it's not a pop-up, it's not, it's just something short where people use the product. That's why I was telling you it's like influencers, right? So that's the new thing. That's the new thing. So if you want your product to become popular, you have to get to the platforms that people are using now, right? Now, a partner with complementary brands. For example, if you're selling pizza, what do you get when you ask for a pizza? Coca-Cola, a drink. Coca-Cola Coca -Cola or a Pepsi-Cola, right? Depending. Yeah. For example, if you are, if you call Little Sisters, they offer to you a Coca-Cola. If you ask for Pizza Hut, they offer to you a Pepsi-Cola. Right. If you buy in, in Subway, uh, you have the option to buy uh, some snack like a uh, lace, lace. lace. Uh -huh. yeah. Exactly, exactly. So that will be the partner with complementary brands, right? So they go like, it's not uh, I'm not just selling the pizza, but I'm selling the cook. I'm not selling only the subway, but also the Coke and the lace. So it's like a Coke, Coke brandy. Exactly, exactly. So 
If your product is new, what you can do is look for a product that already exists in the market that is very popular and you can co-brand, right? So you can tell, hey, let's become partner. My product can complement yours, right? Let's see number five, be active and engaging online. It's not like I will put one announcement today and ah, next year another. Mm -hmm. Very active, right? People are always asking for pages that are updated. They want to know more and they want to know the information that you put yesterday. It's all for today. So people want to say, pero que eso fue de ayer. What about now, right? That's why uh, Twitter has become so popular because you see people is tweeting every single minute. Well, this of the, of the rain, I was checking in my Twitter what the Ministerio de Medio Ambiente was saying every 30 minutes, uh, right? So people want to know. And an example of it maybe could be the, the when the person, I don't remember the name, who posts the, the places where the the COVID uh, uh -huh. was exactly is all the people was uh, searching uh, looking for the information where that information would be um, <clears throat> because they know that every day uh, they post the the location of that mm -hmm. exactly you know these days that was raining so hard that even the classes were cancelled uh, we were watching a, a channel it was a youtube channel of a guy that was presenting alive so he was with his whatsapp account and also receiving messages in the in the in the same youtube alive and people were sending him pictures of different places he was receiving uh, pictures from guatemala from honduras from nicaragua and from el salvador and that was a way of monitoring so as we cannot be there right we were monitoring uh, what was happening around the, 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 the different countries and in that way, you can say, but what does it have to do with, with this? This one, be active, be active online. And by doing that, he got a lot of followers. And was, he was saying, okay, if you want to continue getting more, because what I was telling you, people want to get more and more information in, instantaneously, right? he was getting a lot of people and, and he was saying register or, or click in the in the bell or let me know that that you that you want to continue getting information about the hurricanes right so at the end he collected a lot of a lot of people and as people were asking him can i transmit your information in and he said, yeah, you can do it in TikTok. You can do it in Instagram, in Facebook, but not in YouTube. Very smart. What was he doing? By people getting his information from YouTube and transmitting to TikTok, Facebook, and Instagram, they were just making him more known, right? Uh, no. uh -huh. So instead of he, instead of him being in Instagram, in TikTok, and in Facebook, people were taking the information from YouTube and sharing his information in the other, in the other platforms. What did he say? Put my, my credentials. Show that this information is not yours. Mention the channel. Like that, he was getting more people to, to get to know him, right? So be active online. Now, no more I put an announcement in the newspaper and, and I see to wait for people to come. 
No many people read the newspaper. Well, I don't, right? And if I read it, well, no, I don't read it, right? So I get informed by, by Twitter now. So things have changed. Television is very expensive, radio too. So get online, that's the clue. Now highlight your brand persona personality. What is a personality? Highlight it, so make it bigger, make people uh, know, right about it. Improve the customer's experience. How can you improve the customer's experience? Exposing them more to your brand, right? Tell them about all the things that your brand can do. Show people using your product. Remember in the past, it was very common to see TV offer, right? And yeah. TV offer, well, it still appears. And sometimes you will change channel and TV offer is there and you change channel, another product of TV offer is in another channel and you can be changing channel four times and you will see an announcement of TV offer. Those are infographics, but they are repeating the same information once and once again, right? But now people don't have time to sit down and watch an infographic that will last 15 minutes. That's too much and it's too expensive, right? But you can have the same or a better result putting that in TikTok, for example, in Facebook, appearing the pop-ups in Facebook, right? Or sending infographics to Instagram or some other platform. And of course, track the results. Keep a record of what's happening right? What's going on? Keep a record of that. Okay, any questions? Questions about these tips? Mm -hmm. No teacher, no question. Okay, I'm going to give you homework. For tomorrow, but this is an individual one. Mm -hmm. So, Remember, brand awareness is the ability of customers to identify your brand. See? By the attributes that your brand has. The following are some stages of brand awareness. What you're going to do is match the stages of brand awareness to the description. Do you do it for homework or we do it like this in one minute? Mm, what do you think? For tomorrow. Okay. Homework teacher. Homework back. Okay, so it won't take you more than two minutes. And tomorrow early at the beginning of the class, we will check the, uh, you already saw this too, right? And this one too, so it's very easy for you to do. Well, let's check attendance. Um, hmm. Let's see. Oh, wait, se me perdieron dos, tres. A ver, a ver. Um, Marie, Adriana Maria. No here. Adriana Sofia. Present. Anna. Anna. Uh, Cruz Antonio. Present teacher. David. Eddie Jonathan. Present teacher. Elmer Fabricio. Present teacher. Lisa Cristina. Present. Felix. Se perdió Felix. No, no estaba bien. Grace Michelle. Grace Michelle. Marcela. Ivo Marcela. No hay. Jennifer. Present. Eh, José Alberto. Oh. Present. 
eh, Carla Lorena. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Carla Lorena. Perdió Carlita. Mario. Uh -huh. Nubia y Mario se fue a dormir. Mario. Nubia. Rebeca. Present. 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 Y Rosy. Present teacher. Victor. Present teacher. Claudia Guadalupe. Present teacher. Mauricio. Mauricio. Hoy se queda Víctor, porque ayer le dije se queda Víctor y escapó. Ok, bueno, see you tomorrow. Have a nice day. Bye bye. Good night. See you tomorrow. Thank you. Good night, everyone. Good night. Bye. Bye. -bye. <laughs> Take care. <laughs> Bye, John. Okay. Mm -hmm. Bueno, y Victor. Bye, Mauricio. Bye, teacher. Good night. Good night.